Our next category is Life as it Should Be, Civic or Nonprofit. This is for the coordination of efforts that have enhanced the quality of life in Bakersfield. A lot of nominees here as well. The American Cancer Society. This organization provides several free services for cancer patients and their families. It educates residents about how to lower their cancer risks and it holds several large events annually, including the Relay for Life to raise money for cancer research. Art and Spirituality Center at Dignity Health Mercy and Memorial Hospitals. Run by volunteers, the center is designed to use the arts to help patients and their families heal, both physically, emotionally, and spiritually. Bakersfield Pride. To help promote and celebrate community pride in a safe environment, Bakersfield LGBTQ planned and hosted its 12th annual Bakersfield Pride Festival. Campus Gamers at CSUB. These guys are hard workers, man, I'm telling you. <laughs> Last year, this group raised more than $30,000 during a 12-hour long community gaming marathon to benefit the Lauren Small Children's Medical Center at Dignity Health Bakersfield Memorial Hospital. I wish I could have been there for that one. I missed that one. I don't know how I missed that. Dustin's Diner, a longtime neighborhood tradition, continues to sell hot chocolate, cookies, and other treats to families looking at holiday lights in Hagen Oaks. Last year, $15,000 was donated to the Bakersfield Homeless Center. Keep Bakersfield Beautiful, this nonprofit side of the city's solid waste division, Keep Bakersfield Beautiful, has built connections to coordinate beautification projects, litter and graffiti cleanups, urban gardens, and community-wide recycling events. And finally, Smile for a Lifetime Foundation, with the mission to create self-confidence and inspire hope by providing the gift of a smile. This organization awarded free orthodontic care scholarships to 24 students last year. Our sponsor for this award is Castle and Cook, California. Please welcome Ms. Darlene Mulkey, Vice President of Sales and Marketing. Thank you, everyone. This is by far one of my favorite nights of the year. We get to come together and we get to celebrate what makes this community so wonderful. At Castle and Cook, we've spent the last 28 years building communities where we feel like our residents can thrive and enjoy their life. But really, it is the residents of all communities that breathe the vitality and make this place life as it should be. So it is a pleasure to represent all the nominees tonight in every category. They have been amazing. It's been an amazing night so far. So without further ado, I'd like to give the Crystal Chameleon Award in the category as Life as It Should Be to keep Bakersfield beautiful. Since its inception, Keep Bakersfield Beautiful has become the mecca for efforts to beautify Bakersfield and its surrounding areas. Keep Bakersfield Beautiful works with various nonprofits, businesses, and organizations to coordinate beautification projects, litter and graffiti cleanups, urban gardens, and community-wide recycling events. In 2015, there were more than 13,000 volunteers who signed up to clean up the city as part of the Great American Cleanup and the Greater Bakersfield Green Expo. And this organization's influence stretches beyond the borders of Kern County. Two members, Louis Gill and Sal Moretti, were asked to do a presentation at Harvard University regarding the city's partnership with the Bakersfield Homeless Center to clean up local roadways. Good evening, everyone. Wow, what an honor. Uh, first of all, I want to thank everybody who is behind me and everybody who is here. It is an uh, incredible effort. It takes collaboration of so many people to make this uh, a beautiful Bakersfield. Thank you so much for the Mayor Hall. Uh, you've been an inspiration to uh, keep Baker so beautiful. It is, um, it is your last year as a mayor, but hopefully you will stay on, on this committee because we cannot do it without you. And thank you to all these people here. Without um, them and thousands of volunteers in Bakersfield, uh, none of this can possibly happen. So thank you again. And um, 
everybody who's in this category, you're all amazing. Thank you so much.